The biggest thing I feel like I tell people for airs is all about your timing your, of your acceleration towards the lip. That's how you get pop. You want that acceleration of going faster as you're about to hit the lip instead of losing speed as you hit the lip. You do want to stay kind of pretty mid face. You don't want to be coming from deep underneath, like done a fading bottom turn or anything like that. You know, you want to be pretty controlled coming off the lip with that back foot launching off the lip, as you can see here. You want to um, be kind of pressing right as you get that pop. As you'll see during the air, you want to cork your back arm and your front arm to be corked around in that position well before your board even gets there. My eyes are always coming back down with an alley-oop, back down here, spotting your landing. Like from start to finish, my eyes are already looking back down. You want to get your shoulders, your arms and everything ahead of your board because wherever your shoulders and your head and everything are going, your legs and everything follow. With alley you're kind of keeping your eye on the top of the lip in the transition. And what I did, I just tried to bring my shoulders and head back around to cushion that kind of landing there. On other times, you can be landing on these lips, like fully rotated, and say if you landed back here on this part of the wave and you can ride down the lip, and if you get really low, you can actually get through that shock wave that's blowing up in front of you. But then again, they're the higher risk of injury, especially if you throw one out and you land on where this explosion is coming up. So for me, preferably, you want to be landing on these nice, cushiony transitions out here.